great. Hello. Uh, just be careful. It's, everything is tight, and uh, please don't touch anything because it's fragile as well. Now, if you can maybe crouch down there, then both of you can get a good view. So what you have, of course, is uh, the flight instruments in front of both pilots, captain, first officer. Mm -hmm. uh, you guys, pilots, or no, not so much. No, we're Basic engineers. stuff. Yeah. So. Uh, you know, artificial horizon, airspeed, altimeters, the usual stuff. Yeah. And between them, each of those four vertical rows is for one of the jet engines, telling you turbine speeds, temperature, that type of thing. The little knob to the right of those, on that black face, is yeah. the uh, nose and visor uh, control. Yeah. So you see the two, sh two windshields, the inner one is pressurized cabin, the outer one slides into the nose cone, tilts down, and then the pilot's seats are all electrically powered, they push up so you can see down yeah. at the high angle of attack. How much was it? Twelve and a half degree? Yes. Did you tell to know? Yes, twelve and a half degree maximum. Okay. Uh, up here, Captain Leslie Scott signed that. Two hours fifty-two fifty-nine, and these other ones are all engineering staff that decommissioned the aircraft. Oh, okay. The throttles there in the central quadrant, and then just this side of the throttles, those four little white keys are the afterburners, and they are operated by the flight engineer. Okay. So we just lean forward. Mm -hmm. Um, if you want to look over this side at the flight engineer's panel, this is, I think, the most extraordinary thing. <laughs> no digital computers. Uh, this guy has switches and warning lights and gauges and constantly monitoring all the aircraft systems, air conditioning, fuel, uh, engines. But he has a separate set of engine instruments to those over there. One of the most important instruments is right dead center, center of gravity gauge. All right. Were there many um, people educated to uh, operate these planes? Do you know? Uh, there were usually, at any time, there were 20 crews. Okay, 20 crews. So 60 guys, 20 crews. There was only seven planes, so 20 crews was enough to, yeah. uh, to keep them going. Yeah. Um, and each, each of these guys would spend six months of training to okay, be trained six on this months. aircraft. Yeah. Uh, here's the expansion gap uh, yeah. between these two panels. This opens up about two inches in flight. Yeah. Uh, and I've seen pictures of where, right here. Oh, so that's where the captain put his hat. Yes, yeah, exactly. at the last flight. Yes. Yeah. Okay. On some of them, not this one that okay. I know okay. of. Yeah, some of them, but not this one. Cool. So two inches. About that. Yeah, I've yeah. seen a picture oh. of the hand all the way, you can all the way up to here right. inside oh. there. That's awesome. Well, thanks for coming, guys.